Hey y'all, my name is Chelsea and welcome or welcome back to my channel. In today's video, we are going to be unboxing another owl crate. I haven't unboxed the last couple because honestly, I really didn't care for them, contemplating on canceling my subscription. So we're just going to dive right in. I'm gonna open the box. Ooh. This month's theme was peek behind the curtain. We have a really big bag of coffee. So this one is chocolate eclair, not something I would ever pick up on my own, but I really hope I like it because this is an enormous bag and all the other times in the past, I'm like, I wish the bags were bigger. So they've listened, let's hope it's good. We have this silicone thing, silicone popcorn holder inspired by Where Dreams Descend. I did not like that book, I DNF'd it. It was an owl crate book, by the way. Apparently you can put in popcorn kernels and close the flaps and you put it in the microwave and it'll pop the popcorn. That's pretty cool. I probably won't do that. I probably won't even use this at all. I really don't like the way silicone feels, but it's a fun little thing. I, you know, someone will think it's useful. It's just not for me. We have number four of 12 of the literary luggage pins. I'm still undecided about how I feel about these. I've only liked one of the books that the pins have been based on so far, so I'm not sure if that has anything to do with it. And this one is The Night Circus. Again, another book I didn't like. The pin itself is nice. I like the color scheme, but again, it's just, it's not a book that I care about. We have this little box that says for finding dreams that don't exist yet this is a wax seal kit i've always wanted one of these this is really really cool so it looks like it's a little fox with the moon and stars and a little apple with like a a key a key lock i'm not sure if y'all can see that it's upon a broken heart okay so i don't know what that is useful item that I can see myself using and it's just this is really pretty I love stuff like that we have this box it's another night circus item of course it is so it's a wall hanging clock it actually is really cute I probably will put this in the library but again it's a night circus that's two night circus items in this box I don't know how I feel about that. Next up is a mouse pad inspired by Moulin Rouge. I love Moulin Rouge. I know it backwards and forwards and I cry. I cry every time. So it says outside things may look tragic, but in here we feel it's magic. Iconic it is kind of like creased from being in the box. So that's kind of unfortunate. But I'm pretty sure if you just lay it out long enough, it'll flatten back out. And lastly, feels kind of light on the items, I guess, because they were big. Lastly is the book. I already knew what this book was. It is Hotel Magnifique. I have seen this plastered all over Instagram. I really haven't looked into it. I haven't seen anybody reviewing it yet it is a new release i do like this cover more than the original um, which normally isn't the case Ooh, it is really pretty underneath it says greetings traveler on one side and on the back it says farewell traveler i think it looks really nice i think they did a really good job and these end papers are beautiful oh my goodness I am in love with these end papers. And it also is signed by the author, which is always fun. Ooh, this is a really pretty book. I hope that it's good or I'm gonna be sad. Even the artwork underneath the dust jacket is really nice. So I have no idea what this is. I like going into my books blind, but judging on the theme, it probably has something to do with a circus or stage performance of some kind. This book is also supposed to glow in the dark. So it looks like the title, the author name, and like this, this outlining circle 
here are all supposed to glow, in, but this is what the original cover is supposed to look like. If you haven't seen it yet, I do think Owl Crate did a better job. I like the color. I like the colorway better. And next month's theme is the Chosen Ones. This is for May. See, and we also have a letter from the author that comes with the book. I actually never read these. Maybe I should start. Let me know if y'all are subscribed to Owl Crate. Let me know what y'all thought of this box. What was your favorite item? I think my favorite item is the coffee. Leave me a thumbs up if you liked this video. Subscribe if you want. I'm really trying to get to 50 subscribers. So please, 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 you'd really be helping me out. And I will see y'all in my next video. Bye.